Do you have more? Yeah. It's no more. Hey, hey. Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh. Look at the dog. <laughs> he looks so scared. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Miyajima Island. This is a little island uh, right off the coast, nearby Hiroshima. It's famous for its shrine that's floating on the water, some deer, and then there's also a mountain, I think, with a cable car. You can go up and hike or take the cable car up. Of course, they have the Memorial the Peace Park, uh, which you got a little bit yesterday, and we've been there before. Um, but Miyajima is definitely a place you need to come. Jesus. Luckily, we waited till the weather was beautiful today. Yesterday, it's rainy cloudy weather but the weather's looking really nice today it actually looks like, looks like there's not too many people here which is nice because it's a uh, it's a tuesday we have dustin with us and waba saying waba chan Woo! so we're right here next to the port there's all these little shopping streets and then there it is it's called the otori gate the big bird gate cool i like the sign of map yeah you can take the path all the way up there's even a cable car that goes up see cable car to the top if you want. You can, you can live here, you can stay here. There's like resorts here, I think. So this is the main port. So most people, when you come here, chat, you can take the uh, JR Ferry. So you take the train to like a little port, or just right across the way. You take a little ferry from there to here with the JR Pass. All right, here's one of the little food places, one of the few. Oh, wow, they have uh, ice cream with deer poop inside. Solid, good poops. Is that deer poop? Yeah, that's what this... That's what it says. It's not deer poop, dude. For today, it's called giblets. Deer giblets right inside the ice cream. Look at that. I want to try deer poop. Deer poop ice cream? Yeah. Oh, there's a deer right there. Oh my gosh, so strong. Here they are. Here they are, just chilling. Hello, dude. Nope. <laughs> nah, don't like it. No, he doesn't even foul. Whoa, look at this field trip. What the heck? There's like a thousand kids. Look at that. It's like an army of kids. Holy crap. All right, this is my uh, go-to, one of my go-tos, Sando. We got the assorted, so you get one little tuna, one little ham and cheese with lettuce, and one little egg, Sando. Hey, you've been around, what's the purpose of life? Sometimes I struggle with that same question. And sometimes I forget to ask myself the question, so you lose all purpose. But the fact is that purpose can change from person to person. As a human being on this rotating ball of bull crap, in this short amount of time that we have in the grand scheme of things, the best purpose in life I can give you that I think matters is to use this time wisely by spending it with the people that you love and care about most, creating memories that you remember for the little life that you have, and explore and learn as much as you can in this world. Be uncomfortable, get out of your comfort zone, learn, try new things, and look at it like a video game like Elden Ring where you can just go from A to B and finish the game and kill the last boss and just go through it quickly. Or you can go through all the side quests, enjoy the scenery and everything that makes the game so beautiful. All right, what happened? How's your, how, how's your guys' coffee? I would love to taste it, but I can't stop laughing. Why, what happened? He asked me if I want a straw. I said, no, I just suck on this nipple. And then he just... I don't know. You just start laughing. <laughs> He's coming. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. He's looking at your f that way. Oh no. Oh. Okay. Just share a little bit. No, no, no. You can't feed them. Really? Definitely not supposed to do that. I mean. Okay, why are you scared? I'm not scared. I'm just, why are you scared? Why are you like. Just smell your face, dude. Yeah, just let them be. <laughs> don't bite me. They lick me. You want some nuts? Get over here! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not scared of the phone. Go away! Ow! Ow! <laughs> he has nibbles on my shirt! Buy your shirt! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh! No! Not my nipple! <laughs> hi! Hi! This guy's a menace! Not my nipple! What are you doing? No more. Oh, no. Hey! Hey! Oh! 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 oh, oh. oh, oh. oh, oh. <laughs> I didn't do I didn't let him do it. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. 
Oh, you're stealing the stuff from the people. Oh no, she's already eating. Dude, it went behind these people and just stole their <laughs> Look at eating. <laughs> What's it eating? It's so cute. Very nice. Damn, look at this. It smells like ocean. Dude, this shrine's like straight out of a video game. And then also the deer poop. Yeah, I get some deer together. poop, yeah. I think they call this place like a Mote Sando, Miyajima Mote Sando shopping street. It's like a little souvenir street. Maybe some little restaurants. What the heck? It's the freaking gatekeeper of the Fukuya. I don't know, but he's in front of the door. No, it's so thick. Mixed fruit juice. Mochi. Oh, that one's mochi. Oh, they have yeah, oyster kare pan. What is that? Curry like pan. It's like the curry bread, but it has an oyster inside. Ugh. Mm. I'm not a big oyster guy, so. Oh, look, this is, this is a grilled oysters right here. Look. Oh my god, I can actually take one. What's some other food I don't eat? I don't, I don't. I don't like oysters. Most shellfish, I don't like. Some shellfish like that kind of stuff. I don't really mess with too much, but I'll eat it. What else? What else do I eat? How about an ass? So by the way, we just walked by a little a place that sells a little like uh, in the shape of a leaf, little maple leaf, uh, little cakey thing. That is a uh, Hiroshima specialty snack. Yeah, let's try it. Hello. What's the most original flavor? Red bean. Red bean, smooth or coarse? Ooh, nice. And they make them here every day? Oh, there we go. Our delicious little momiji manju. So it's, it's kind of like um, it's kind of like a leaf-shaped hayaki. Maybe a little sweeter, let's find out. All right. Huh. Everyone take a little corner. Wait, why does red bean look so gray? A gray bean. A gray bean? Why does it taste like mellow? Maybe there's better ones out there. Oh my god, what happened? I'm hoping that there's better ones. I see Water wore her buffet pants today. Water did wear her buffet pants. Oh! Don't do that. No, I'm just showing you. Yeah, I mean, it's like every every meal we have, they, they slowly get unzipped. Here's a sweet potato special place. Oh my god, is that the chestnut? No, sweet potato, wait. That's so big. Wait, those are chestnuts? That's chestnut, look at this. It's oh my god. Wait, that's so big. God damn. Well, what's he doing? Is that a cannon? Fishing. Oh, careful, it's a cannon. Oh my god. What's happening? He's cleaning the pipes. Oh, it's like a pressure cooker. That sweet potato is so cute. It's like a it will, cannon. It will be popped inside. They're roasting ah. inside. And then the chestnut will pop. Got it. Oh, big fugu. Fugu, yeah, blowfish. Oh, look at these with the butter. Yeah, they have like some piece of uh, na, 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 oh, unagi. Uh huh, unagi. Yeah, a little unagi on top of the oyster. Hmm. There's a little, little speaker right here. Oh, this is so cool. They have different faces. Yeah, he said, he said the faces are all random. What? Look at this. Aww. Good fortune store. <clears throat> Very, Whoa. This is very Chinese feel. A lot of gold Buddhas. Yeah. And dragons. I love dragon and Buddha and belly and like money. We just got out of the, uh, I think it's called like Miyajima Omote Sando shopping street, tourist street. Now we're gonna head to the shrine. This island is actually called Itsukushima. I'm sorry, YouTube. This is Itsukushima Island. And we are going to Miyajima Jinja, which is the Miyajima shrine at the Itsukushima Island. Deep this fried. is basically a fish cake churro. Yeah, deep fried. Look at this one, it's zoning out. <laughs> this one's probably... He's meditating. He's this like one probably uh, found some wild mushrooms. We're in Itsukushima Island now. If you do go to Hiroshima to come here, you definitely should check it out. Really beautiful little island with a really cool shrine floating in the water, kind of, they say. Some deer here, which is kind of cool. And a nice little shopping street. But uh, yeah, throughout the coast of Hiroshima, we're at Hiroshima yesterday checking out the uh, Memorial Peace Park, uh, which is a kind of very sombering, is that the right word? Dedicated um, to remember those uh, that died during the uh, atomic bombing of Hiroshima uh, during World War II time. We didn't go inside the museum, I have been there before, but something that I think that when you do come to Hiroshima, you definitely need to go to see, hopefully remind us of the tragic stuff that's happened and to help us continue to strive for more peace in this crazy ass world. This is the uh, peace arch. Wait, that's real fire? 
Yeah, this is the, uh, the torch and then the arch straight ahead and then the museum's on the far side. Yeah, it's on like one line with the fire and this, uh, what's it called? The, uh, dome, the atomic dome. dome, yeah. So in so one line. This is for peace around the world, man. This is what it used to look like. Look at that. Beautiful, baby. Absolute B E A. Beautiful. Yeah, last time I was here, the water was all the way receded out because it was low tide. And they have a little barrier here. So the water, it'll be wet here, but you can actually walk out and take a picture like near the shrine. It's called the Big Bird Gate, actually. What's the purpose of the gate? Uh, probably to the heavens or something. Uh, you probably walk. To the heaven? You probably walk through it, you transport to the final boss of Sekiro, and he's just like this freaking feathery white robed samurai man who just slices and dices you. Probably, probably what happens. Samurai fool! Yeah? Oh, I see a fish, Chad, look! Whoa, hello! Only one fish, that's crazy. Round one, fight! Oh my god, bully! <laughs> He's like, ah. oh my god! Uh, the same, same kind of thing. <laughs> I think the area we have the photo is just as good. Oh, this is the pagoda. I mean, yeah, the, I think my favorite pagoda <laughs> photo in Japan is in Tokyo, actually, at Asakusa. I think the one in uh, Kyoto is really good. The Golden Temple, whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's true. Whoa. Looks fresh. Do you guys want some? I want to get that. The octopus? The octopus. The Go tentacles. for it. Whatever you want to get. Uh, Look at that, dude. What is that? Is that what your dandan mian look like? Dendemian? Sprinkles on there. Oh, oh my god. Dude, that dendemian yesterday poop? was so good. If you guys missed water stream, oh we had this really, god, really, really yeah, delicious yeah. dendemian in, uh, sorry, in Hiroshima. It was so good. Yeah, look at this. Mm. Oh my goodness. And now we have tentacle porn. Jesus, look at those things. Whoa. What the hell? Did you slurp that thing up like a noodle? <laughs> just ate <laughs> Oh, yo, get right. What's up, dude? Damn, all the homies are here today. Dude, this guy's gonna go crazy for this squid. So Dustin used to be a professional dog trainer. So he learned about the butt technique. If you put your butt in the dog's face, the dog will go away. You have to sing this song. It's like... He's still listening. Look at the dog. <laughs> he looks so scared. Got a little song for you guys, chat. Soak it in, boys. We got recommended by a local uh, Hiroshima Harry on, he said, the best Okonomiyaki place in Hiroshima. And it's actually owned by a Venezuelan guy? Guatemalan. A Guatemalan guy or something? Yeah, it's the best one, trust me. Well... Just get one. Just get one? Yeah. Uh, maybe two, okay. Maybe two, okay. Those are huge chestnuts. Ooh. Thank you. I can't wait to see you put Ooh. these hot, big nuts in your mouth. Mmm, smells good. I would love to put these nuts in my mouth. Not gonna lie. All right, guys, we are uh, heading back now. There's two ways to get here if you guys don't know. The first way is the most common. You can take the JR train uh, to like the little port across from the island, take a ferry over. It's all included on the JR Pass, very popular, and it can ferry a lot more people. But the one that we opted into is actually a, a boat that goes from the Memorial Peace Park to Miyajima, and it's uh, a direct boat. It takes about 40 minutes or so. And it's just a little bit more convenient if you're staying inside Hiroshima City. You don't have to transfer any stations or anything like that. Stop putting your finger in my butt, Water. No, I didn't do it. You Dustin. just, you can't. What? what the hell? Water, you gotta stop putting your finger in my butt. I did it. That, what? I, Can someone I tell me, seriously, I know. It's a real thing. Why do your girlfriends have this weird obsession with putting it there? Stop, you just did it again. It just feels good. No, it does not. <laughs> it does not for you. This is the way I live. Still. All right, boys, we're getting on the boat. I'm on the boat. I'm on the boat. Hey, 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 hey. Wow, so beautiful with the sun kind of. <laughs> this is Peace 
park right here, chat, by the way. That's the piece, yeah, there's the dome. So you guys are gonna see the, uh, the atomic bomb dome or the, the bomb in Hiroshima about 80 years ago, 600 meters high and 150 meters south east, I guess, blue. And uh, this is the, the only standing building still in the city. Uh, we'll kind of cover on right here. Uh, at the time, but the only building that still stood in the vicinity of it. Take a moment and uh, remember that we need some damn more peace in this world, dude. All right, guys. Well, there you go. The World Heritage Route to Miyajima. Hello. <laughs> Dude, I was looking at the Google reviews of this restaurant and I sorted it by the lowest review possible. And the number one lowest review is like, I came here on a Friday at 5 p.m. It was from four years ago. I came here on a Friday at 4 p.m. It was closed. No service is bad service. One star. The restaurant replied and said, I'm so sorry you weren't open today. My mo This is the day my mom passed away. Oh my God. Emotional damage. You guys are curious, the restaurant here is called Lopez Okonomiyaki. The local spot, by guy, this is named Lopez. He's actually not even that move, but very famous. And one of my, uh, our heroes, team of friend, recommended this spot is his favorite Okonomiyaki in the entire city. Some interesting things that are a little bit different here, mainly the jalapeno, definitely. You won't find this in most places. I got the vegetable one and I added green onion. Water got the yudon, and Dustin got the soba. Ooh, the egg on there. So Okonomiyaki ready to go, dude. He's cooking them up, dude. Cheers, guys. So basically, the um, okonomiyaki is slowly cooking over here. So that's the meat on top with the veggies. And then he flips it upside down so the meat can cook. And he adds whatever veggie or... Ooh. Green onion. Uh. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. We just had a delicious Hiroshima style okonomiyaki at a place called Lopez. That was awesome. Um, it was recommended to me by a local and as you saw by in there, there were some foreigners but there's definitely some locals in there hanging out. So it was quite delicious. Today is gonna mark the end of our, I think very bountiful Hiroshima day. And I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did don't forget to like and subscribe and follow jake and bake live as well as waterland and myself